Strictly Strings, Book 2, page 27. Learning triplets and new terms like sostenuto, playing with a sustained, smooth style, and sforzando, a sudden, strong accent. First tune. <laughs> Notice how in example one, the two four time will end up feeling a little bit like the six time. This teaches you that triplets often can feel like a six eight time signature. So when we start in the beginning, we'll count one, two and a, one and a, two. And by the second half, we'll be counting one, two, three, four, five, six. If you were to conduct this, they would both be conducted in a two four time signature conducting style. One, two. One, two, and a, one, and a, two. Cabbage Down focuses on some double stops with 16th notes. Please play the song two times. One and a two and a three and four. when you can add some slides and enjoy and have a little fun. The next song, number three, Pilgrim's Chorus by Wagner is from the opera Tannhäuser. This is Andante Maestoso, so it's kind of slow and majestic. Notice the accents. There are some dotted eighth and sixteenth note rhythms mixed with triplets. So don't forget to count to three while we play this one. And a one, two. One, two, three. One. Counting to three really helps for that one. The Academic Festival Chorale by Brahms is slow andante, sostenuto, very stretched and sustained style. Adding vibrato can help. And notice if you have any shifting, any finger indications of what finger you need to use. And here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> Another cantabile, a very beautiful lyric melody, the theme from the Firebird Suite by Stravinsky. You can play unison with the A part or you play the B part while I play the A part. Look for the sforzando ending. One, two, three.
triplets and some of those fiery little sports ondas in that last one.